to One Piece Dungeons and Dragons episode 44. First of all, happy birthday, Noble, 44 years of age. What a... Ah, uh, feels great to go. You look younger right. every day. He's getting Hi. up there. He's getting no, up I'm there. Getting older. <laughs> I know it's been a, it's been a very long time since we last did uh, had One Piece D&D hosted by me because Briggs went on holiday and then Tekken did his movie. Hello. But we're back. We're still in the Oasis. Things are still going down. Um, I'm back here with, obviously, Duras, Lost Paws, um, William Tekking, hey. Verona Too Spooky, Hi. Ragnar Briggs. Hey, yo, the, what up, guys? The whole gang. Before we started the recording, so this will not be on the YouTube version, we were all talking about the days that we were conceived. And yes. <laughs> uh, except for the people who don't know. Uh, but that will be lost <laughs> to time eventually. Because that's yeah. only going to be on the board. It's not It's not going to be in the actual recorded version. So, I'm, uh... you know, benefits <laughs> of being here live. Um, <laughs> last time where we left off the gang, they, they were formulating a plan with the, the casino mob dons to take down Big Top. But whilst doing it, they uncovered a mystery of, a, of these mysterious mannequins that could take the forms of people that they know. And they had just found one of these little hidden hideaways and were attacked by a group of five mannequins uh, before we did the To Be Continued. So everyone's already rolled initiative. The, the, the start of this episode is immediate combat. It's immediate Shit. mannequin madness. Uh, by everyone, I mean Verona, Duras, and William. Ragnar hasn't rolled initiative yet. Um, oh. oh. <laughs> Ragnar came in. He came down the ladder late. He's like, um, oh, shit. What's going on, guys? It, it, it's dark in here. Why are there wooden things? <laughs> oh. uh, and also, Louis Leclerc. Is Louis Leclerc still tied up, or did you guys untie him? Uh, we haven't gotten to that point yet, I don't think. Yeah. All right. I don't think we've gotten to him yet. Have so we? He, we he's. Went down there and uh, yeah, he's on the attack. Well, yeah, yeah, yeah. But you did find him. We, uh, yeah, we we found him and we're like, oh hey, and then all the mannequins were like, oh shit. Okay, <laughs> all right. Well, there were five mannequins as they surround you. They no, um, they crowd around the group. Verona, you are first off. <laughs> <laughs> well, as we remember from last time, Verona's not a big fan of these mannequins. No, okay. nobody so is. I'm d I'm just going to immediately ah! scream and just start blasting. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like Verona specifically has memories tied to wooden creatures that he is not a fan of. Um, so Bing Bing Bong, Bing Bing Bong. You wait, wait, which which are you? Which mannequins are you hitting? There's oh. five of them. He just uh, starts. So, okay, so, uh, it just yeah. doesn't matter. <laughs> so he started. Okay, so what I, basically what Noble just did. Like on this map, we have there are multiple mannequins like surrounding. Just them. around them. So I'm just gonna boom boom boom, just every direction. Just that three. I, can. So I mean, you say, they all hit. Oh, hell oh shit. Well, the okay, three that are like right in front of me, basically. Okay, sweet. So, boom, boom, bong. Boom, 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 boom. I want oh, you in my room. Hanky. Uh, no, they're not. I typed the wrong number in. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> don't, don't worry about it. They're less tacky than you think. Okay. Um, all right, sweet. William, what do you want to do? Uh, As your bullets okay. fly off, the wood splinters off the mannequins. Um, uh, William is not quite as terrified of these things, but they are very, very creepy. So I'm just going to go with the standard rogue strat of running up to um, one of the mannequins, the one that's closest to me right yeah. here, stabbing it and then hiding in a box that's behind me. All right. One of the ones that uh, Verona has just shot. You're going to run up and yes. get it. You're going to get sneak attack bonus on this because wait, will you? Yes, you will. Because you get no. it all the time. He gets it all yep. the time because oh. he's oh, a yeah. fucking swashbuckler rogue. Yep. Yeah. It's a He's uh, you hit him. Okay. I realize I'm not showing yeah. the rolls on the stream, am I? Yeah, I, maybe not. That might have been a setting that I might have messed up last time. No, I got it. I got so it. I got it. Uh, that's not 100% you your fault. You can't minimize it. I got it. So I got it. Always keep it. Yeah, yeah. guys, I'm, a, I'm an idiot. It's here now. Um, that's a crazy amount of damage. I, yeah, I, I, I love how it shows red if just one of the sixes is, yeah, is a one, like, wait, even though the rest <laughs> of it's like, really still. good. Yeah, the rest of it's really good. That's why I natural always think it's a red. red. <laughs> natural 20 red. <laughs> yeah, natural 20 in the red, yeah. Um, you deal 34 damage to this to this wooden mannequin. Okay. Uh, I mean, slicing off one of its wooden arms. It's still standing. They they have some resistance to them, but uh, it looks... Not, a, not, and not that it matters, but its uh, speed is also reduced by 10 feet because I okay. did slashing damage They are very then... slow-moving mannequins. Actually, I think you might make this one immobile by doing that. 
Oh, okay. <laughs> All right, sure. Yeah. Um, I'm going to then uh, try to jump in one of the crates, probably the one by Louis, so that way I can maybe untie him on my next turn. Uh, um, can I do that? Are you, I mean, yeah, you disengaging? Yes, disengage. Sweet. Cutting yeah, action, my, disengage. With, cutting action, disengaged. And you, want me to roll for stealth for no, that? Wait, no, you're not, you, don't, you don't have, you can't stealth. You can oh, just okay. disengage. It's either disengage that's or stealth, right. but that's fine. You okay. still take cover, you know? All right. And okay. they will not be able to reach you because they're very slow. So you you, All right. you dart back, jump inside of a box. There's ah. Louis LeClock's tied up body next to you. You're peeking Shh, up over shut. the box. Louis, don't say anything. I'm uh, hiding uh, in this box. You're very bloody today. <laughs> I okay, wasn't I'll going to... to I I'll was literally you, uh, not saying turn. anything until you start decided to talk to me. Then shut up! <laughs> okay, now it's the mannequins' turns. Uh oh. Hey, Verona. Three, hey. three mannequins. <laughs> three, <laughs> three mannequins. I mean, they're all just closest to Verona, and he did just shoot. They're gonna walk up to you. Um, the mannequins are like vaguely in the shape of like regular dudes, like grunts. Uh, of some of the other people that are tied up in this room. Um, okay. And they are going to just smack you. Uh-oh. Okay. You're going to take six hits because they each attack twice. So I might as well just damn. roll it six times. Oh, oh, damn. God, damn. I will use Zawolfo. All right. Oh. Uh, yeah, you're in range to do your, that. What's your, what's your AC? Oh, I forgot to do the uh, turn it. It's 17. Uh, I will block the critical hit. Yeah, then. I think you would. Yeah. That was a good idea. <laughs> Probably, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, and I will turn off the uh, advantage thing because I'm a stupid idiot. Um, uh, advantage toggle, please. Okay, so the mannequins come forwards and start just beating a shit out of you. Um, I actually only a couple of them hit, uh, dealing 22 damage to you. Um, one of them is about to hit with just amazing, perfect. Uh, critical ability, fucking smacking you directly in the face. But in that moment, a wolf spirit jumps out of Juris' arm, um, armor and like grabs the, the mannequin and goes, oh, woo! <laughs> Verona is very thankful, but he's too busy screaming internally right now. Uh, oh, well, that's it. That's their, that's their attacks, Juris. Oh, wait, no, there's, hold on. Oh, sorry, there's two other mannequins. There's two yeah. other mannequins. Uh, oh, good. Yeah, one of them's going after Duras and one of them's going after Ragnar. Hey, Ragnar. Oh. You ready to get mannequined? Sure. <laughs> Let's see. Uh, 18 oh. and 16. He's uh, uh, I blew up because of my shield. They both hit me. Oh, oh, oh yeah. They both at, they those both are at Ragnar. Dura, oh. yeah, yeah, they're both at Ragnar because he's... Oh, um, shit. They, they make two yeah. attacks each, so that one's a Ragnar. That, that texture. These guys are made of wood. <laughs> he knows. <laughs> I didn't. It's a dark room, okay. I didn't notice off the complaint, like, like off the looking. To be fair, they I don't. Felt. Yeah, yeah, they don't really look wooden because they're like mimicking the forms of human people. But they are. Once they hit you, you can tell they're wood. Um, does the 18 and 16 both hit? Both hit. But I you 15 armor class. You half the damage, so 26 halved. You could do the maths, Ragnar. Um, and then the other mannequin's gonna attack Duras. Oh no. Um, and here it comes the best rolls of its life. Oh yeah. Tw one hits. And 20, 26 <laughs> and 20. Why is it Why is it that Duros, you why? have such high armor class and that that when anyone rolls against you, they just always beat it. He Yeah, he hits you with the 26. Not the 20 though. Yeah, not the 20. I block one. You block, you <laughs> block one. one. <laughs> it punches you in the face. <laughs> oh, sucker punch. You're, you're so confident with the first shield coming up and blocking the wooden body <laughs> that you're like, haha, they can't hit me. And he just, <laughs> boom, just get called swallowed in the <laughs> face. Oh, oh, um, mighty blow there, friend. All right, well, you take 12. And now oh, it's your turn, Doris. Right. Okay. Um, let me minus 12 off that. All right. And I will see this one that just attacked me. And I'm like, how dare you? And I unsheave my benevolence and I will try to use a trip attack on this son of a gun. Yep. If I can. Um, yes! You critically yeah! hit him. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Let's All right, go. So, and I need to roll a one. Holy shit. Candle. I know you have an advantage on it, but it would have been the first number anyway. Um, um, and he needs to make a strength save. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. So add four to whatever this roll is. So uh, seventy-one. Ten. So he fails. Plus Twenty-five. It is not prone. Ha ha. You you roll two d tens because a critical roll uh, doubles all dice. So oh. roll another d ten. Be a ten. Be a ten. Come on. Come on. That's eight. Oh, pretty okay. good. 
Good enough. All right. Yeah. So All right. 21, 8, 4, 12, 12, 12, 21. I'm doing the math. I'm typing. I'm typing. 33. 33. Let's go. I mean, that was just one attack, to be fair. And now, oh my God. one attack, he falls over, slams onto the ground. Now you do have an advantage against him because he is on the ground. And then I step over him, and now I have my two extra attacks at advantage. And I will now wail on his face if I can. Yep. <laughs> wail one, wail two. You hit him twice. Let's go. Fucking dice. Tw Twenty six. That actually, I know that actually kills it. So, oh my <laughs> God. How, yeah. Go. How do you slay this mannequin? This wooden beast. I chop off. Uh, well, I, I chop off its legs, and then I chop off its arm, and then finally I slash through its neck and cut off its wooden. You just head, nugget I guess. it. You turn it into a I'm little a wooden nugget. chicken nugget. <laughs> yeah, right. And I, I mean that mannequin's dead as fuck. Damn, Duros. Damn. Oh, that felt good. It's been a while since I've been in combat. The thrill of battle is at it again. <laughs> um, quick question. Last week, did I turn into a bear? Uh, I, I, don't... I don't think we would have had a chance. We, didn't get, we weren't in combat. No, yeah, okay, we, we just started in... at the very okay. end. Yeah. Well, then, never mind. Yeah. I took off my temporary hit points because I had clicked that I was in bear form, but it wouldn't make sense. So, okay. Okay. All right, Ragnar, you're turn. up. Well, is then that... I'll start off my turn. By raging and going into bear form. Yep. Use use the axe, Ragnar. Oh yeah. And frenzy. Fuck that. Do oh, it all you're just going oh, mental on these fucking. Let's go mental. Hoppers? I didn't go big bear. I had no hop. Okay, okay. Yeah. okay. <laughs> I just like in the box, and he's just like, I'm glad I'm hiding in this box. They're going fucking crazy out there. After getting like body slammed or punched by oh, the mannequin shit, and realizing that it's heal. wood, I just like smile and look at my axe and go over my head and like swing down like I'm chopping firewood on top of the mannequin next to me. Go ahead. And this does double damage yeah, against it wood, does. right? It hits. This should kill the shit out of me. I mean, all three oh, hits yeah, do that, the damage. That should be annihilated. All right. Whoa, whoa, okay. Well, you cut it so hard it turns into a perfectly crafted coffee table. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, 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 double that 100, you're gonna kill him. It actually, it, actually, it, wouldn't, it wouldn't technically double the fives because that isn't your axe damage, that's your bear strength, but doesn't fucking matter, who cares? You will kill him with the double damage anyway. So how do you split this mannequin in, uh, in half? I, again, for the very top of the head, like it's just like, like I get the chunk of wood being cut as firewood. Just carve him to pieces. It's exactly. He's not no no. I didn't aim for the ankles. No timber. You know, like normal. You know what, Ragnar? He's not even worthy of that. You know what, Ragnar? What happens is you cut the mannequin so well that there's like a dust cloud, and then in its place is like a perfectly created piece of furniture. <laughs> 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 oh, wow. What a beautiful chair right now. Let's bring this to our next uh, our next dinner. <laughs> there we go. Perfect. <laughs> okay. Um, Louis LeClock is still tied up. Um, so he's just going to be there tied up. Verona, it's your turn again. <laughs> I'm just, listen. Verona is losing his mind right now. He, so he's still just going to be blasting the three that are yeah. attacking. You have today. disadvantage on your range because they're next to you now. I do not have the time to realize that. Oh, wait, you said disadvantage, right? Yeah, disadvantage. Well, yeah, I forgot to click it. Ignore that first. Or... Yeah, yeah. We'll ignore that one. Yeah. That good wow. roll. That's I will <laughs> we'll see those better rolls. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's with... I got a 29. That was with disadvantage, by the way. Should I Should I just roll, like, Holy another normal? To, like, nah, nah, do another one. disadvantage. I want to see it. I want to see okay. you get crits with this. 16 still hits. Uh, still. They all hit. How? In, okay. I mean, you have a plus 13. <laughs> he does. Because, <laughs> because he has, like, all of the bonuses to his accuracy, which is why it's ironic that he still hits his teammates. Like, <laughs> yes. that's what Verona has yeah. done, is over the course of this entire campaign, he's done everything he can to boost his accuracy, um, and he still hits his teammates. Part of the crew. <laughs> Maybe that's, that's just what I want to do the entire fun. time. Huh? <laughs> we all have scars from Verona. <laughs> that's how we know we're family. How many times was I shot by Verona? I think at least three. There's at probably somebody three. on YouTube oh, that's, kept, that's kept track of that. Definitely yeah. more than three, I feel. Yeah. <laughs> I, I think I've been hit like twice in one episode before. <laughs> it's how he shows his affection to his family. Okay. <laughs> so it's not that much damage though. <laughs> yeah. Um, just an even spread across them. Uh, you're, mm -hmm. you're kind of like spinning in places. The bullets are flying off. Yep. Uh, <laughs> Just, uh, ah! Wood chipping off each individual mannequin around you. Um, all right. William, what's your all plan? Right. 
I, I've just after witnessing Duros and Ragnar completely annihilate two of these things, William's just going to climb out of the crate and like, I don't even think I need to try to be all stealthy and tactical here. I'm just going to go over and cut Louis free. Ah, merci beaucoup. But the... um, omelette du fromage. Uh, so, yeah, you are, I, you are speak. <laughs> you are my, you are, that is my captain. He, he allowed me to I speak my language. <laughs> Somebody told me that when I ordered uh, a scrambled egg this morning. Anyway, the point is, like, I think everybody is handling these mannequins. I thought they were kind of scary at first, but I don't think we really need to worry about it. Like, <sighs> Ragnar just cut one of them so damn hard, he, like, made a chair. So, Boy, it's like... your door, it's your door. Oui, is, oui. That, is that French for chair? I don't... <laughs> <laughs> no, it's French for door. Oh, okay. Well, he did. He didn't make one of those. But anyway, um, yeah, that's my that's my turn. Unless I could do something else. <laughs> I want to clarify for anyone that it isn't French for door, just in case people get. Uh, okay, I was just, like, just I in case people get that. upset with me, it's French for thank uh, for for love. It's French for love. Oh, okay. Well, thank you. Love. I love but... you too, Louis. Thank you. <laughs> oh wait, no, it's Italian. I think. Never mind. Okay. <laughs> All right, you guys got this. I freed Louis. <laughs> Okay, okay. Good job, Captain, as I'm like <laughs> carving it. I'm so confident that they're going to win that I'm just like, all right. So, maybe, well, yeah. Verona, okay. you're going to get gang rushed by mannequins still. <laughs> Good luck, Verona. <laughs> still screaming. Oh. <laughs> uh, I will use the wolf to block, uh, I think, a 26 one. Sure, the first yeah, attack. Yeah. I'll reroll that only, one. Then. Only two of those hit, anyways. To ten. Let's okay, go. yeah. So you block the first one. The first one comes down. The, I mean, the the wolf is still there, just like blocking shots. <laughs> yeah, just... I think maybe in canon he's actually just blocking all of them, just like <laughs> except for like the one that goes through. Um, that he just misses. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you just take eleven, Verona. You're good. Mm. Nice. You're chill. You're vibing. Well, not really, but yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, a wooden thing. Yeah. yeah well, it uh, Duras, you're up. To help Verona okay. if you want to. Oh, everyone uh, could just like leave them. I will try and finish off the one that's weakened. <laughs> so I will go over and I'll uh, move over to. Actually, yeah, I'll still be. Just move over here and I'll attack the one that's weakened. Yeah, there's the one mannequin that that took the damage from Willie. Oh, I mean, you. That. You. You, you destroy Nine it. Of damage. Yeah, you destroy yeah. it. Very good. So I lop off its head in a clean. Flop, like a bowling pin. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god, that's great. And it collapses to the ground. It's a this wooden mess. Fun. We're, we're having fun times here. Yeah, I mean, sometimes combat's gonna be easy for you guys, because you're not always gonna be fighting life or death against, like, big boss enemies. Sometimes you're just gonna be fighting mannequins in a room. And then I see Ragnar next to me, I'm like, do you want to carve another chair? And I'm gonna try and hit this guy two more times. I mean, you go. do. You hit him two more times. Why is Duro suddenly, like, popping off like crazy? Uh, <laughs> 23. 12, 23? Yep. And then I will also use my bonus action to use my shield bash to knock it to the floor so Ragnar can do, oh my God. do away at it. I assume it has to do a strength save? A strength save, yes. 15. It fails. Oh, my it God. Fails. So, yeah, you knock it down to the ground. <laughs> <laughs> Ragnar, you now have advantage against this mannequin. I walk over, look down at the mannequin, and say, I think I need a matching coffee table. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, uh, oh. 21, you hit. 21 Do hit. the damage for that. No, no. Do the damage oh, for the first one first. One you could, time. Yeah, you, you kill it with the first one. Oh, I think that was Okay, so <laughs> I didn't want to use all three great axes against the one mannequin when I was sending another mannequin out. Just like Makes chopping sense. into its I, dead body. I love how that axe was like, oh, it's double damage against wood. That's never going to come up again. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you you cut down so hard that the moment your axe touches it, it just transforms into a coffee table. <laughs> it just like it just like pops. Um, I've acquired a new special ability. <laughs> <laughs> All the work I spent on that dining room table for the for this like that meeting. <laughs> <laughs> like you, I, I, as in, you don't, it, you're not even carving it at this point. It is just like the moment the axe makes contact with his head, he just, in a puff of smoke, c completely turns into coffee table. Um. <laughs> All right, well, I have two more attacks. And yep. I'm, I'm, it looks like I'm within range of the other mannequins. So yep. I'm going to watch, walk over and be like, well, this is just sad. Well, the second one does hit. So do the damage for that one. All right, and then do your final attack. And the final one. Hmm. I'm gonna throw a hand axe up in the air. 
<laughs> okay, the hand dog is man <laughs> trick shotting these things. Oh, I still had advantage. It would. Uh, it's fine. The twenty six is the eleven. Actually, would have also hit. They have a nine armor class. Um, trick shot. <laughs> trick shot. It doesn't hit you. I, the the axe doesn't do double damage. The hand it axe. Not. It just. <laughs> so I mean, you do that twenty, uh, that twenty five or whatever, and that's a that cuts into it nice and clean, right? It's like half a chair. But then the axe flies into the air and just cuts into the into the creature. It's still it's still alive. It's just like stuck. In I got carried away, guy. Like, Finish it off. <laughs> <laughs> it's 360 degrees hand axe. Okay. Well, now it's Louis Leclerc's turn. Louis Leclerc um, stands. I'm playing. I'm I'm over by the box playing poker with Louis. Uh, Louis goes. Ah, you beat me again. I gotta take Royal my flush. Ah, flush. take what my anger out on something. And he stands up. He walks over to the mannequin. And he goes, L Louis, you really don't need to. I think they got this taken care of. <laughs> I am just really angry right now that you beat me in cards. All right. Um, and he walks over to the to the mannequin and yeah, he's going to use Napoleon. Um, Napoleon. Or, uh, 21. I don't know. Well, fuck it. He actually doesn't <laughs> even finish him off with the six plus six. <laughs> he, like, Louis, he, like, <laughs> he, he, he fires all the bullets into into the wooden mannequin. Um, it barely like scratches him, and he's like, "Ah, oh, c'est la vie." And then he walks back <laughs> and sits back down with William. Um, okay, well, let's let's see here. All right, all right, Rhoda, you're up. <laughs> <laughs> Still just house. screaming, but this time it's all focused right in front of me. Mm -hmm. so. You doing okay, everybody? Boom, boom. All right, boom. Oh no! Oh, oh, there. <laughs> Way to go, uh, Verona! Another one. A and double that's disadvantage. And that's on a disadvantage? Double a double, a double crit? Disadvantage. Double critical! <laughs> oh my double god. Double crit disadvantage. What? <laughs> Another. So listen, I am so terrified right now that this. Come on. You didn't I even need, need to fire something. the three shots. Well, the, <laughs> the first one was a critical fail. It still hits. <laughs> it still. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, it's still, it, I guess it does technically still hit because their armor classes are so low, but it's still a critical fail. So I'm gonna say, I'm gonna say it like, I don't know, the bullet like explodes in the barrel and like hit and you get a little bit of shrapnel in your eyes, uh, okay. but it still does damage to the opponent. Um, <laughs> My eyes have been closed anyways, I'm scared. <laughs> I, I mean, just roll the damage for all three, including the crit. Right. Dude, I just picture like it goes down after the first one, and he just keeps on shooting it on the floor. <laughs> yeah, I mean it does. It literally goes ah, down. Boom, the, the first, yeah, the boom, first, boom. first bit, it blows it apart, and he's just shooting <laughs> at the wooded pieces on the ground, screaming. <sighs> it's just a mannequin. Are you all right, Verona? <laughs> what happened? You Let don't understand. <laughs> <laughs> no, I don't. That's why I'm asking. <laughs> Back when my father was first murdered, and I had to hide out in the woods. What? For weeks on end. I saw shit. What? In those woods. Mannequin? You, you lived in fucking At mannequin night. forest? <laughs> At what? night, things would move around. I and they looked the like people. But I they put down weren't the cards fucking and I'm just like... people. <laughs> like, right, so man. things that look like people. Freak me out, okay? I mean, Louis, Louis Leclerc comes up and goes, hey, <laughs> Verona, what's the matterkin? Get are, it? Because it's you like, right, Verona? like, what's the matter? I'm shaking. I, I take out a little notebook and write that down. That was funny, Louis. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, because it's like mannequin, but matterkin, and you're my, like, the crew is like a family, so you're like kin. And... They call I get that it. place the Uncanny Valley for a reason. Oh my god. That you you went to a place called the Uncanny Valley and it was full of mannequins? <laughs> it was full of things <laughs> that oh looked god. like people. You sure it wasn't called the Unmannequiny Valley? That's <laughs> <laughs> Okay guys, the humor's starting to calm me down. Thank you. <laughs> uh, you're, you're welcome. You're welcome. <sighs> Verona, this backstory is so unexpected, but I really need to hear more about this at some point. <laughs> is is that why you killed all the people on that ship and sunk and killed thousands of people? I was trying to help. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. It's all right. We killed all the mannequins. Wait, are there any more? Wait, there's people tied up in here too, aren't there? Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Oh. I should probably should have oh. go let them free. They're like unconscious. Playing poker, but, yeah. but oh, okay. Well. That... Oh no. <laughs> all right. I'll I'll go and cut them free <sighs> as well. Yeah, yeah, and Doris would also help, of course. Yeah, yeah. yeah. You you cut them free, free, and um, 
I mean, they're still unconscious. I mean, do you want to wake them up? Yes, sure. I will. All right. I roll. Mean? What do I roll to slap them awake? I just or, fucking slap them. You don't know, roll anything. <laughs> or uh, Whoa, hello. Yeah, hello. Are you fine, friend. Ha, ha. Eyes open wide. Ha, one of them opens. Um. Ha. Hello there. Where the fuck am I? Why? Uh, cr creepy mannequin murder dungeon. How did you get down here? I mean, I was in Big Top's prison. Cause I did a, oh. I did a minor crime, and then um, you know I, I didn't actually do the crime. By the way, I was framed for it. Was that a crime that's not very severe, or a crime that took place in an actual mine? It was a crime that took place in a mine. I was trying to rob the prospector. I mean, oh, I wasn't. Like I was idea. allegedly trying to rob the prospector. <laughs> I didn't actually do it. It was I, Jimmy, I, I, and he, he points over at another guy, and Jimmy goes, "Hey, what are you, uh, what are you talking about? I ain't done shit." <laughs> Uh, I got this look, one away, Captain. <laughs> we're we're pirates. We don't really care what kind of crimes you committed. Um, but you know, we're looking for we well, were looking for Louie. We found him. Um, and now we're just a uh, big top is uh we're trying to take him down as well. You're trying so. to take down Big Top? Well, oh yeah, that I'm all in support of that. He's kidnapped one of our crewmates. Um, that's I'm so sorry more? about that. And, um, I, I, so, you guys rescued her already. <laughs> yeah, we, we oh, yeah. <laughs> I, I, <laughs> it's weird. It's like, I have, like, this weird She's amnesia fine. from, like, two months. It feels like I haven't been here for, like, two months, even though it's only been two minutes. Uh, I was, I was dreaming about monkeys and stuff. It's, it's, yeah. it's weird. Something about yeah. a banana. I don't know. <laughs> the moment you say, the moment you say banana, everyone notices the, the banana sword that's on like, like Verona had this banana sword on hit on their hip the whole what is time. That thing? <laughs> oh my god, we had a cool adventure that I completely forgot about. I suddenly remember being trapped, taking a shit, and like weird things going on, and like some guy with a machine gun and a monkey. I don't know what's going on here. Oh wow. Well, I was How long have I had this thing? <laughs> I don't know. But, but we had a damn good vacation after it, I feel like. Hey, Verona, well, is that a banana in your pocket? Yeah, just happy to see us. <laughs> <laughs> well, actually, Duros, it's a sword, but. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> For. For information, please go watch One Piece D&D, &D, the movie, Lost in the Crystal Lagoon, now available on Netflix and... No, <laughs> not, a, not available on Netflix. Hey, speakers here in this. <laughs> not available on Netflix. Okay. The the random goon continues his story of, yeah, fucking Big Top locked me up in there, but some weird fella uh, freed me and then knocked me out and stuck me down here. That sucks. What did he look like? I didn't really get a good look at him. I'll be honest. Oh, what about you, friend? And, and he looks over. Was it Vinny? His name? I don't know. Jimmy. Jimmy. Okay. Hey, what about me? Do you, this is the. Did you get knocked out by the same person? Do you have any information? No, I would never be knocked out. I was awake this whole time. I swear it. Swear it on my mum. Swear it on my dad. Swear it on my grandma. Oh, oh. Swear it on my granddad. Great grand. Oh, well, I'll go swear back. So much. Swear it on my <laughs> ancestor. How far are you willing to go back here? I'll, I'll swear it on the dawn of man. One piece Adam and Eve. <laughs> Jimmy, Jimmy, I like, I like the way you talk. Would you like to join my crew? Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> Baba da boopy! <laughs> I feel like this guy's telling the truth. Um, I, I, I don't death. doubt a single word he's said so far. Baba da boopy. Uh, uh, oh, I like your moxie, kid. <laughs> well, I'm, uh, I'll take that. I'll take the offer. Right. I'll try right, to join. Cool. Fuck it. New member of the Devil's Luck Pirates. <laughs> Uh, Captain. <laughs> Let's at least give him a trial. Let's see what he's capable of. Okay. I, I uh, see how he does against Big Top. Are we going to kill Big Top now? Or I, I mean, that was the do? plan. I mean, we could always maybe use him as cannon fodder too. I mean, I mean, we'll we'll find out. But, cannon fodder I mean, is I, my I, middle name. He sounds cool, right? Like we have Louis, who's from this France place. This guy sounds like he's from Italia place. I don't know. <laughs> <I'm>... <laughs> 
Wow, <laughs> this is the greatest day of my life. I'll tell you, I'm so happy, man. Well, That's well, great. <laughs> well, then, Mr. You know, Dooney, I'm, I, I'm, you, I'm so happy. It might even make me want to woohoo. <laughs> okay, feel free to wahoo. <laughs> All right, well, here's, yeah. Wah wahoo, yes. <laughs> wow. All right. Okay. Well, <laughs> is there anything else down here in this creepy basement? Um, there was the half-eaten bacon sandwich, obviously, because oh yeah, but, yeah. Um, oh. because the uh, the perpetrator did pay a vision visit to the uh, bacon was... sandwich shop. Okay, any of I the think mannequins. It'd be a waste not to eat the sandwich, guys. I think. I like, mean, if you, you guys just... want the sandwich, you could have the sandwich. I'm not going to eat the sandwich. I uh, don't mind if I do. <laughs> this could be the, like the last official bacon sandwich. Sure, I mean, it's pretty stale at this point, but you can't eat it. Yeah, Ragnar can eat anything. In a while. Any of the mannequins that haven't been turned into dust or coffee tables, are they like, can I look at them to see if there's any markings on them or anything? Or are they just creepy wooden dolls? Um, I'm pretty sure all of the mannequins that were in this room came to life and you destroyed. I don't think there's any. Okay, so, there, so there's nothing left but yeah, just yeah, start yeah. A, a, a sawdust and uh, sawdust and, and heartbreak. And and yeah. Yeah. And heartbreak. <laughs> I just want to say Ragnar sheds a tear while eating this stale sandwich. For, <laughs> for Kevin. Oh, oh, for Kevin. For Kevin. <laughs> The Thank last you. one. The last Kevin? <laughs> bacon sandwich. Oh yeah, I guess that is the last bacon sandwich he ever made. Yeah. And oh, you're no. eating it right now. Cherish this Instead moment, of putting Ragnar. it in a museum, Ragnar, huh? <laughs> I don't even know what a, mu a museum is. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, okay, that's fair. Yeah. Make a history check. <laughs> no, I mean, Save <laughs> just one crumb. Save a crumb of bacon in honor of, of Kevin. Mm-hmm. I'm gonna All go right. bury the rest of this sandwich. <laughs> like a little <laughs> grave. <laughs> you're you're no, making there's nothing holding us back. You're making a grave for the sandwich before you even make a grave for uh, Kevin Bacon. I thought uh, we made. I thought we had a whole. I made a. I made a grave. No, we had a. We had a proper burial for Kevin. Uh, I thought Bacon. you just chucked him in an alleyway, but I guess I that was it a proper wrong. burial for <laughs> Kevin Bacon. That was the bacon eating sandwich alleyway. Alleyway. No, but bacon yeah. eating no. sandwich alleyway was a people, not a place. <laughs> yeah, that's true. And yeah. that and that people is dead. Yep. Um. Anyway, um, I I guess we could get out of this uh, creepy dungeon and let everybody yeah. out. Um, if there's nothing else that, of interest down here. Well, it is underneath a toilet, uh, so yeah, it doesn't smell so well. I mean, no. more of the people are waking up now. Okay. Uh, and okay. I, I mean, another guy wakes up and he like rubs his eyes and he looks up and he and he goes, Ah, what the fuck? What's going on here? Creepy mannequin dungeon. Just if you want to leave, the exit's that Wait way a through a toilet. You guys are the devil's luck pirates. <laughs> he points over, <laughs> and he goes, I take oh. off my hat and like, and then okay. he he points over at Ragnar and he goes, "You're the guy who flipped that table like a few months ago." Hi, I'm, I'm, I, I'm just I'm, I'm one of I'm one of the elephants, guys. Uh, you probably don't recognize me because we normally wear masks, but you flipped that table over and I had to get it repaired, and I'm not I'm quite irked about it. I'll be honest. Uh, <laughs> I, I understand well, you we are... have this fine chair that we can offer as recompense. No, I mean, I understand... <laughs> I understand you were having a little bit of a, a temper tantrum and you were actually trying to fight my boss, but I'm a bit miffed that the table had to get in the way, right? I, we bought that table and we had to get uh, a replacement. I mean, Do you, that was like do you know how much ago, we get paid? We're, not much, right? We're, well, actually, I'm thinking you didn't just spend your money on table. that table. Well, we had to. I mean... Casinos make a lot of money, okay? And sometimes tables need to be flipped. I, I just, you know what? I flipped the table that the bacon sandwich was on. And I was <laughs> He's a, this guy is a monster. You, we goons, yep. we, we nameless goons of Mafia Dons don't even make minimum wage, okay? I just, can you at least apologize? I don't even remotely feel bad. I, uh, <laughs> man, I'm having a... <laughs> what, what are tables for? Other than to be flipped in dramatic moments. This is a really weird, uh, like, out view on the concept of tables. Um, I mean, you could eat all of them, Ragnar. We, we do that occasionally. It's true. Oh, how the turn <laughs> tables. <laughs> what, what's better than flipping a table? I've made thousands of tables in my day, but, like, when, think about it. Four equal legs and then flipping it over completely. <laughs> that, that's like Ragnar's, like, he just has an urge to do that whenever he sees a table. It's just like, gotta flip it, you know? Do you, do you just make tables just to flip them every time? Sometimes. Sometimes I'll make a table from scratch, flip it, and leave it there. Just to scratch that table flipping itch. Mm. I see. 
Well, that's why we're that's why you're the shipwright on our crew, Ragnar. <laughs> <laughs> I was wondering why we had that one room dedicated to all t- tables. It's just, that were yeah, over. it's a room full Very of upside weird. down tables. <laughs> it looks like a fucking Absolutely. madman's house. <laughs> that sounds proper- like part of. That sounds like part of a workout routine, just flipping tables. I, I was, was going to say, it's a, it's a good workout. You got your hamstrings, your glutes in there, your arms. You know, if you use your full body, I'm going to flip yeah. my next opponent. Top, big top, I'm going to flip him. Let's flip oh. him off. Oh, you, you, you lot are fighting big top. I'm, oh, I, yeah, we're going to fuck that guy I, You know what? I forgive you for the whole table flipping thing now. I fucking hate that guy. He put me in a prison. Well, Uh-oh. he's a dick. He put We're me in. Go... He put me in prison because I was trying to steal a table to replace the table that you flipped. <laughs> That'll be... That sounds. That sounds like a dick move. We should go kill him. Yeah. Well, yeah. I'm all for it. I mean, I'll tell my boss. He doesn't like him. Well, that, that was the plan. Nice. I mean, we were trying to get all of the dons to work together on this. You want to get all the dons to work together? I mean, we were trying to. <laughs> we, we tried kind to of throw. Already... It... Did we try? We, uh, you we all... throw a thing you got... giving dinner. You got all the dons to work together. Whoa, that's crazy. <laughs> <laughs> they, they are currently right now sitting at a table that I made that will be that flipped has later. not been that will be <laughs> not been flipped but will be flipped later on there's nothing that unites men more than unflipped tables that's what I always say you're gonna flip it yeah, that was a, that was a long like dining room table are you gonna flip it like from the end like like vertically or just horizontally oh please don't flip that table. that's a good that's a that's a good question <laughs> Well, we can think about that because we should go on our way now to tell Let's them. Let's get out of here. All right. Mm-hmm. We got our crew. I did pretty much have nothing the dogs been fight. sitting at that table this the whole time or did they leave? Well, Gravy's <laughs> with them, so. Uh, yeah. I I don't know. You said you'd reconvene in the evening to, to, to plan the attack was your initial mm-hmm. thing, if I remember correctly. Um, yeah. So I guess even if they've gone away, they would have come back by now. Mm. Okay. All right. All right. I guess you guys leave the toilet. All right, let's leave the toilet. Come along, cabin boy Jimmy. Hey, I'm a cabin boy over here. Let's go. Woo! <laughs> to mop our poop deck. I mean, come I'll... on, it is pretty. I mean, man, I'll do anything for the coin. <laughs> I'm always chasing that bag. You Does know. He know he's not getting paid. <laughs> I mean, I, well, I'll give him paid? some money. I'm not. Yeah, we, you all have money. We're pirates. We share things equally. Well, yeah, we steal the money, but he, we're not paying this guy. I'm always on that grind. Grind life. Let's go. I'll I don't have him. money. I give my money to Verona. Gravy's food. Barbari- is, barbarians don't have pockets. We're giving so him room, room and free food. I think that's payment enough. Mm. I mean, that's what I had in prison. Uh, okay then. <laughs> so then there you go. <laughs> I know what that life is like. I'm on that Sigma grind set. Let's go. Okay. Um, so which building was this in? Was this in the? Um... It was in one of the other taverns, I think. Yeah, one of the no, other no, taverns. No, 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 no. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah. Because we went to two of these in the last yeah. episode. Yeah, yeah. Listen, yeah. I can't remember what the fuck this tavern's called. You leave it, and the bartender. Okay, we... Bartender's like, thank you for 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 joining us in the tavern that I forgot the name of. Um... <laughs> You took a long time in the. I don't know. You there was a lot of you went into that toilet at once. Oh, and you know how it goes. Let man. me tell you, we made a big mess. <laughs> I, you all came out of that toilet like clowns coming out of a clown car. <laughs> um, oh yeah, <laughs> That's it was. How we it, do the, it. This is the ace Thorough of the hole. Grab the nose, guys. It, this is the ace <laughs> of the hole. It was. It was a very funny joke. Um. Anyway, get get get, get out of my get, get out of my establishment. All right. So, all right, all right, guys, come on out. It's like more people. <laughs> <laughs> just like, yeah. I'm on. As, as, as they come out, you're hearing like, bow, 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 like circus music. <laughs> and then the bartender's like, hey, shut the fuck up. And he like throws like a like a glass at the band. <laughs> catch it. <laughs> oh, yeah. so Wolfo like comes out and like protects them and catches him. <laughs> okay. All right. All right, all right, all right. So I guess you guys leave and you you head on over to the to the to the grand dining table with all the all the mafia dons uh reconvening. You can you can tell it's getting dark. The light that shines through the um the water is dimming. The uh the the artificial lighting of the city is reflecting off the golden surfaces of the houses um and with this orange with this orange glow. It's a very, Aww. it's a very nice scene. Um, scenic. 
you would turn. I mean, the the mafia dons themselves are not really looking at each other. They're kind of talking to their own boys. And as as you rock up, the elephant turns around and goes, "Right, look who's arrived, huh?" Hi. Hi. <laughs> so what's? Hello, friends. <laughs> Good news. Captain, We've rescued why are you friend. always so awkward? <laughs> yes. so, <laughs> because I'm Captain <clears throat> William. Uh, um, the, we, we've also seemed to have rescued your, your friend who's, who oh, loves yeah. tables. Oh, sh shit. Ah, uh, oh, fuck. Um, welcome back. Uh, it's great to have you back. He uh, pats, pats the fellow on the back. and But you could see like he's a little bit annoyed. Maybe he like re already replaced him or stuff, something. <laughs> um... <laughs> And doesn't want to pay oh. for another goon. It's okay. I think he's going to be our cabin boy. Uh, no, that's no, that's Jimmy. Jimmy. He's the cabin boy. Oh. Different guy. Jimmy's there's, like, there's hey! Right Yo, Mafia Dons, what's up? Man, big fans, big fans, big fans. I have, I have, I have all the merchandise. I made it myself. Big fans, Elephant. Yo, is that the Prospector? Prospector turns around and goes, Yo! <laughs> you are the ones that were trying to steal my gold! Yeah! <laughs> I ain't having that. He like runs up. He's like, "This is Jimmy and Jomi. <laughs> they were trying to steal my gold." It's okay, sir. He's on my crew now. You. Well, apparently, I think they said they were framed. Is that right? By Big Big Top. Yeah, what? that too. Oh, you saying it was Big Top trying to steal my gold? Just added to the list of reasons I want to kill that damn bastard. So, what is the plan, huh? Well, we got our crew back. We know where he is. There's nothing to stop us. I we feel got our, like yep. vengeance is needed. I think it works. We could just basically, let's just charge into the place. We're going yeah. We're going all out assault sort of deal? Damn oh, straight. Yeah. Woo! Oh, yeah. We some tables. Yeah. Ragnar, if you, if you would. <laughs> all right. Guys, to start off our, our whatever, our adventure to take on Big Top, everyone grab one side of this table. Okay. <laughs> Roulette goes, wait, what, what are you talking about? Why, why are we grabbing the table? Just go You'll with see. it. You'll okay. see, just grab the underneath of one I mean, side of the table. Elephant puts his hands underneath it. The prospector goes, puts, like, digs in his mining pick arms underneath it. Um, I guess Friends. all of their goons come around as well. All right. Friends, t together, as we flip this table, we'll show our unity in this battle. Three, two, one. Whoa! <laughs> the table flips into the air and it flies up and spins in slow motion and crashes down to the ground. All of the leftover food and decorations going everywhere. And everyone cheers. Hey! <laughs> Yeet. Yeah. So, so here's the thing. Good? Here's the thing, Rustage. So I was going to do the inspiring leader thing anyway now to give us all a boost for HP. Can that just be it? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, of course. Because that I can't inspire more than that. That was a, a, a moment of solidarity between, between all of us. I mean, what do all you, right, okay, yeah. What do you roll for the inspiring? Um, HP? it's my level plus charisma modifier. Everybody up to six people get temporary hit points of that. So it would be eleven plus um my charisma mod, which is three. So everybody gets fourteen extra temporary hit points. There you oh, go, wow. gamers. Nice. Everyone's got that fourteen. So it would be you guys, so the four of us, and then two, two other people. So well, who else is here? I'm giving 14 extra hit points to Jimmy. <laughs> hey! <laughs> Shit, I'm like, I'm like 10 times as healthy. <laughs> Whoa, I could do I get, anything. <laughs> I give that to Jimmy. Jimmy and Louie both get 14 extra hit points. Okay. And Louis goes, oh, we oui, oui, this is good. This is we like, j'adore, j'adore. All right. Wait, do I have okay. to make a fucking token for Jimmy now? Is he coming I with you? I guess he fight? do. <laughs> we got oh, hey, fuck at yeah. least Cyril and Pearl aren't with us. Okay, they aren't with us. So yeah. They, yeah. So I do mean, we still have Lissa with us. No, Lissa, Cyril, Pearl, and I guess Gravy now are all just back at the ship. Okay. Yeah. That's Gravy what I wouldn't thought. go to fight They're, they're back anyway. there with Inspector Sterling, just chilling out. Yeah. Okay. Um, cool. Hey, do you Let's... want any of them with you, or they're just gonna stay up there? Well. Well, we got to think about this. Okay, it's the four of us, plus we got... The Mafia Dons are coming with us, right? The casino bosses. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. They're coming with us, plus we got Jimmy. I mean, who else do we hey, need Hey, I'm Jimmy over here! And Louie, too. I know so how to rustle wanna... him. 
if you yeah. guys want to stop off and get Pearl, because she's the she's the mad G. I mean, I yeah. mean, with people getting kidnapped, we should probably just leave. Yeah, her. let's keep. Yes, all right. Around. Let's like just rock and together. roll. Let's just do this. Pearl can keep the ship safe. Baba da we booty. Hey, <laughs> we started a revolution over here. Jimmy, do you have anything to fight with? Uh, not anymore. I, I hand him my gun. I hand him my gun. There Whoa! You go. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> this is is a steam pistol. No, I lost that years ago. Oh shit! Well, this is just ago. regular gun. That's just just a pistol, <laughs> pistol. Yeah. Hey, I got a gun over here. <laughs> oh, fantastic! Jimmy has a gun. Everybody, this man has a gun. I'm shooting <laughs> here. Let's go. Hey. He can't do any more damage to us than I already have. Yeah, I'm, ha <laughs> I'm, I'm handing him my gun and a few of those clown grenades I still happen to have in my pack. So he has hey, to I'm okay. going to strap to I'm getting, <laughs> I'm getting like, already fully equipped over it. here. <laughs> oh, my God. All right, Jimmy, are you ready for I your mean, first battle? As this is all going on, you see Jommy in the background, just like arms folded, like looking like <laughs> so upset, like staring at Jimmy, <laughs> like. <laughs> <laughs> all right. So, yeah, I, I, if everybody is OK and set to go, let's just let's just charge on Big Top's uh on his, uh, his uh, base, whatever all it's right. called. Well, they, all right. uh, they, they all Unless got... Unless you want to stealth, Captain, I'm really good at that. <laughs> they I all mean, got goons. Like, I mean, if you have an idea on, like, how to make our entrance, like, Ragnar, if you just want to throw a shit, like, throw a table into the building or something, however you want to enter, I, I don't still know. Ha I still have the chair that I yeah! have from the mannequin. I would have definitely taken it with me. I wouldn't have left it there. Um, good chair. Like I flipped the table that I made, obviously, but the right. chair is coming with me. So as we're walking forward, I throw the chair through one of the windows. Yeah. <laughs> the devil's like, pirates are here, motherfucker! I mean, you guys walk up and, yeah, it's sort of a reminder of the layout of this whole thing. Almost everything is in, like, this big circular like dome, but there's like a singular like tubal path that goes up to a secondary smaller dome, which is where Big Top has his like c huge casino. It's almost like a casino castle. And All there's right. the huge gates of that casino castle that were open previously for Duras to get through. I, the whole the whole army, this Devil's Luck Pirates, the uh, the Elephants Gang, the Chess Pieces, the Prospectors Miners, they, you've got a group like a solid group of like, I'd say if each group had like 20 to 30 people, you know, you've, you've roughly got about 100 guys, 100 oh, boys, nice. you know, rocking up at the front gates of Big <laughs> Top's castle. Um, I love this. <laughs> uh, yeah, Overtaken plays. Dun-dun-dun-dun-dun. Dun 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 dun. Yeah. I might even just play it, even if it gets copyright claimed. <laughs> Let's just do it. <laughs> okay. Da, 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 da. Okay. Um. Yes. No. No. Not only that, but you guys enlisted the aid of uh, some of the eight flames as well. So Hemlock. Um. Uh, oh, they're popping up too. Wow. Yeah, Hemlock's there. Fucking. I think that's the only one. Bullet. Bullet yeah, is there too. Yeah, Bullet would be yeah, here. Bullet. No, no, yeah, Bullet's too. probably still recovering, actually. So it's probably... Yeah, she, it's was, honestly, she was beat up pretty bad. Probably, Blake is still kind of down. It's probably just yeah. Hemlock, because Blake's right. kind of depressed. Bullet's been beaten up, and everyone else who's now part of the Eight Flames is kind of not a fighter. They're just like... Ready ready for a fight, Hemlock. I hope you brought your petrifying knife, because that thing, that thing's fun. <laughs> I always yeah. keep that thing on me. Nice. Yes. All right. Man, this is right. nice. We're leading an army, guys. This is cool. You you walk up to the front gates, and um, I mean they're obviously locked. I mean, what are you gonna do? I go up to like Ragnar. Okay, Verona, you have an idea? No, nope. go ahead. Do what you're gonna do. I was just gonna say, Ragnar, you're you're the loudest out of all of us. If you want to announce our arrival and do something cool, you're the best guy to do this. <laughs> just lead the charge, honestly. <laughs> I mean, I don't know if this is gonna work, Captain, but okay. Big top! <laughs> oh, you coward! Throws the chair over the over, <laughs> over the thing. <laughs> over the thing, <laughs> guys. I don't know if that's gonna work, but like, we can also just try to break the lock. Yeah, I think it's best I mean, just <laughs> to try and break it. Or you know, you have we have lock tool. picks. <laughs> you just oh. gotta, you gotta I mean, that's lock fine. Pick All right. the front gate, and it's slowly. I'll try open. to lock pick. I'll, yeah, I'll just fuck try it. To pick you open. can if you want. <laughs> I'm like ready It'd to just like, really everybody charge! Hold on a Hold second. Hold on, let me let me just fucking like lockpick this gate. 
I mean, we don't want I to mean, grab it. I mean, you yeah. lock pick it with a 28. <laughs> of course you're still going to pick it. Yeah, of I, course. I lock pick it with my sword. I'm just like, chick. And like, okay, here we go. We're yeah. good. And uh, the, the gates open up. And you see this huge golden casino, you know, roulette tables, golden chairs and furniture. Um, and, I mean, there's just a bunch of, like, a, they, they look like mafia gangsters, but they're wearing, like, gold mafia suits. And they all turn around and they all got their guns. And just the moment the gates open, everyone Hello. behind you, like, all of the mafia dons just fucking charge in. Right. I'm rolling my devil fruit right at the start. Roll your here. devil fruit. I'm, I, I'm sure Ragnar goes big bear. Wait, no. No! <laughs> <laughs> that is... All right, so that was funny. So, no, 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 no. That's not, that's not an address or anything like that. That's not my address. That's Wait, Noble's yeah, address. Yeah, he's fine. It's fine. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 no. That's fine. That's fine. Uh, it's I think it's cut off for them. No, no, no. I, I scrolled up. up. I scrolled up. I scrolled up. I scrolled up. No, so you're it would fine. Be okay. You're fine. That's nothing. That was something else that's not even relevant to anything. Okay. Yeah, don't worry, so don't, don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Can we delete that? Can you delete it? I mean, you can clear it's, chat it, log. it's already on there, but uh, like, whatever. I don't you, you care. Could just, you could just clear chat log. That's it's not like my address or anything. You know? <laughs> I just saw like an, an address. We're, we're <laughs> planning a trip. We're, we're, we're going to Anime Expo. We're all planning on doing a trip to that. So we were looking at a bunch. I was looking for a bunch of like places to stay. And that was just one of them. So that might not even be the one we end up staying at, though. Oh, so I, I clicked like, clear you know. chat log and it didn't fucking happen. And now nah, you're fine. It's cool. That's nothing. <laughs> Okay. Yeah. Okay. Fine. Uh, back nothing. Cool. That was. Yeah, that was I copy funny. and paste. I usually copy and paste the D one four hundred and ten <laughs> because I, mean, I want it to be quick. You already right, just copied and pasted the. All right. Two hundred thirty six. There we go. <laughs> oh, back to I the game. Get up this devil fruit roulette. You can produce and manipulate coffee. You got the coffee, coffee, know me. I'm I'm re-rolling that. That's so <laughs> stupid for a fucking raid on. All right, all right. Let's yeah, try man, that get again. Get that coffee, bro. Get hyped up. Get that energy. Get haste. You're like giving out little cappuccinos to everyone as they roll food. Wait, like, wait. Yeah. Can I can I just do that cheat thing, or have I already done that? So I want to. Now that you brought it up, I'm gonna I'm gonna yeah, explain this to everyone. Bring it up on how this works. Um, bring that up on so how this works. The idea of Tekken being able to choose a number is so that he has a little bit more control on like the cheating thing, but the. But I don't want him to be able to use something he's used before. So we've we've introduced the rule that he cannot choose a number of a devil fruit he has already rolled. It has yeah. to be a new number. Like he he has to not know what that number is. Um, All right. Yeah. But I I okay. Can I go? Yeah. Can I go. pick a number? Choose a number. All right. You know what? Devil's luck. Lucky seven. I thought you were gonna say sixty nine. I really thought you were gonna say sixty nine. <laughs> I think I, I already too. rolled. I think I, I already too. rolled sixty nine. Um. <laughs> It's the wax wax fruit. Okay, I'll take it. That's not bad. It's <laughs> not bad. That's good for restraining people. That's yeah. good. All right. Uh, yeah. I I'm a wax you, man. Sure. You'll, you'll be able to cast hold person and other stuff like that. Whatever oh, you say. Also Logia too. Yeah, right. yeah you make, become I wax. Make, I can make wax armor. I can make wax walls. I could do a bunch of shit with that. Yeah. Yeah. He just can't turn into wax. No, I can't turn into wax, but I can like cover myself with wax if I want. Oh, yeah. So yeah, it's yeah. not a Logia. Never mind. No, no, not a Logia, but still really cool. Yeah. Mm. All right. Okay, you guys, you you become wax. Your wax body. Uh, okay. It habits you. Um, everyone's charging into the battle. Uh, shit's going crazy. So immediately, like brawls start happening. You um, elephants, dons start like beating up a bunch of casino people. You see them fighting. Um, I'm sure you guys are just going straight down the middle, like beelining for Big Top's castle. Like that's um, right. Mm -hmm. um, you see roulettes, like chess pieces, you see Rook like knocking people out, you see pawns fucking people up, you see a guy with like a knight's helmet uh, uh, fighting people, you see a person with like a bishop's helmet who's just attacking people but he's only doing it diagonally um, <laughs> <laughs> and, and, <laughs> and they're all doing that right, like they're all only attacking in the order that they can um, see the prospectors guys going crazy, they brought sticks of dynamite and they're just throwing it at people and blowing stuff up. Um, and you guys running down the center, you're stopped by these two goons. Um, there's one guy, he, he is a dice man. He's got a dice head, di his body's completely made out of dice. And the other man is like, he's got a human body, but his, 
you know, human face, arms and legs, but his main body is a slot machine. He's got like a big slot machine lever on him. And they okay. stop you, and one of them goes, Ha! Huh? I am Big Top Second Commander! My name is Pip the Dice Boy! And the fo- the other one goes, Ah! I am Big Top's First Commander! My name is Slots! <laughs> <laughs> I like, like the he aesthetic. Looks just like you. I like these guys are okay. Screw you, Duros. But I like these guys. <laughs> I like these guys' aesthetic. Yeah, I get it. Okay. <laughs> aesthetic. Yeah, I get it. That's a good rhyme. That was a naturally good rhyme. It was a double. What? What did I? Did aesthetic. I, did I rap you just said. Now? I like their aesthetic. Yeah, I get it. All right. Cool. Post this shit on Reddit. <laughs> yeah, <it's done. laughs> Don't forget it. I got all that comma. I get it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, all right. So I've got to put fucking v- Jimmy in here now, I guess. Yeah. Yeah. Jimmy's yeah. got my gun and he's got a few grenades. So there you go. We're he's, arming Jimmy. He's got my gun and a few grenades. And people are like, "Hey, I hope Jimmy. Jimmy's gonna die in this episode." No, Jimmy is. I want him to be our our new member of the crew. Right. I, I hope. I he gotta wins. shoot him first. I gotta. Yeah. Shoot him he's gotta yeah. get inaugurated. What if he while. shoot Jimmy? You will probably kill Jimmy. You will probably <laughs> kill him. <laughs> hey. We can just revive him. It'll be okay. Okay, that's fine. Yeah, that's fine. 14 extra hit points. He does have 14 extra hit points. But 14 is not a good number for us. No, it isn't. (laughs) We're all dead. (laughs) Oh, lucky 14. Let's go. (laughs) All right. Well, Jimmy's got like, just to describe him, he's got like slick black, black hair. It's kind of like pointed. Um, And he's got quite sharp features. Uh... I don't know. And he's just, I guess he's wearing like a typical, like, kind of like mobster. I think he probably does have like a fedora on it, like a black fedora now. Um, Jimmy for Pirate King. Jimmy for Pirate King, let's go. Uh, I gotta, let's go. Oh my god. Jimmy. Uh, with his. Oh, Jimmy. Jimmy. That's it. Hey, my Jimmy. It's okay. my name, Jimmy. Hey, what's going on? What's cracking, guys? Hey, don't hey, worry, what's Jimmy. Guys? You'll, you'll make it through this battle. I know it's kind of a crazy uh initiation into the uh, devil's luck pirates but don't worry you'll succeed all right oh, thank you what? man can i get a boy go huh can i get a boy go over <laughs> <laughs> nobody in here he's walking here nobody on this crew has ever di- nobody associated with this crew has ever died jimmy do not worry all right guys <laughs> Should I tell him? <laughs> I'm trying to just bolster his confidence. Guys, right I now. want you guys to roll yeah. initiative. Um, I got to roll for Jimmy. Yeah. I got to make a character sheet for Jimmy. I mean, I'm literally. Sure it's just like a D20 plus two. <laughs> I don't even think it's that. I think it's just a D20. I don't think he has any dexterity. I don't think he really has many skills. He's, cr- he's no, kind no. of. He's yeah. just a dude, I guess. You know, but... I'll probably just pull up the like bandit. The bandit like yeah, default. Yeah, Bandit default, guy, because yeah. that's what he is. He was just a a, a a petty criminal. Yeah, yeah. We, we gotta ah, find him Jimmy the most overpowered me. devil fruit, guys. Uh, <laughs> yeah, here we go. I got Bandit, and I'm gonna change the crossbow to a gun. Nice. Uh, that's good. That's good. Gun. <laughs> so just change the name. <laughs> okay, that's him. That's him. Hell yeah. That's Jimmy. Good to see you, Jimmy. Uh. And yeah, I guess roll that initiative for Jimmy. I will. I will do he that. Better than me. I'm just gonna. Jimmy, laugh. that'll be so I, funny. I, I believe in you, Jimmy. He got 14. I hope Jimmy gets the, he got Jimmy better gets than you. <laughs> I'm, I'm out of here. All right. Jimmy, Woo! good job, Jimmy. Jimmy, let's go. All right. All about. That's oh, what God. I'm talking about, Jimmy. Okay, Verona, you're up. What are we for? All right. We're not here for you, blockhead. And I'm just going to shoot the dice guy three times. The blockhead's good. <laughs> Sorry, someone said Jimmy deceased. <laughs> uh, <laughs> it's really no. good. It's really G- good. I saw Jimmy Wheeler, <laughs> and I like Jimmy Wheeler. That's mm. a good one. After but... I say the comment, I'm just going to lean over to William. That was funny, right? <laughs> yeah. No, you were hilarious, Corona. That was oh. great. And then bang, bang, boom. Oh, these are... Te- oh, here no, we go. No, no, no. Holy oh, shit, I mean, I mean, that last one is definitely going towards Jimmy, and the... <laughs> okay, why is it Jimmy? You're welcome! You're welcome! Let it hit me, You're let welcome. It hit me Rustin! I'll take Jimmy. the bullet! Uh, oh. I'll take Jimmy, the bullet no. for Jimmy! No, it's initiation uh. for Jimmy. Okay, only one of... Wait. 16 hits. I just want to point out, yeah. it's literally 15, or 16, 15, 14. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Those are like <laughs> your so worst three rows. Rolls. 16 uh. does hit, though, so you do one point. Now also roll <laughs> for Jimmy. All right, let's salute for Jimmy here. 
Okay, he's fine. I mean, yeah, he's, he's still got the temporary hit points, so he's good. Jimmy, yeah. you're a part of our crew now! <laughs> Welcome to the crew, Jimmy! Jimmy <laughs> Welcome. Welcome the I'm crew. bleeding here! I'm bleeding! Oh! It's <laughs> alright, Jimmy! That happens it's a official. lot! It's official! It's official! <laughs> he's part of us now! Oh, you going gosh. all the way to the new world, boys! Oh. Jimmy, you can do this! Alright, do the you damage. I believe in you! Twice I like point. how I called that immediately. Wait, did, I, did one of the other ones hit? Yeah, 16 hits. Oh, okay. So do the damage. Yeah, six. Hell yeah. <laughs> We did it! William, you're wrong. Oh. <gasps> <gasps> All right. Um, okay, so now that I have wax powers, I'm just going to throw this out there. Can I try to just, like, just cover this slots guy in wax? And it hardens harder than iron. Can I try to, like, incapacitate this thing or paralyze it, petrify it with wax? <laughs> what do you like think? Grapple checkers. Oh. I'm yes, going to... Something. Uh, no, uh, oh. Because that's what it is. He literally, like, in the story, he turns yes. people into wax statues. All right. Like, that's what he does. All right, yeah. all right. This is what I'm going to say. It's going to be a okay. two-part two part system, right? All uh, right. You need to first hit him with the attack. Okay. And then once you hit him, he will do a strength saving throw to, like, be able to break the wax before it, like, all hardens right. around him. All right, here we go. Yeah, because there is a phase before it becomes yeah. completely hardened. Okay, devil fruit yeah. attack. Yeah, that's Patrick. 23. 23, okay. 23 you do hit him. Okay. Uh, now, what does he have to beat here? Well, whatever your fucking saving throw thing is. All right, let me check that. <laughs> uh, spell save is 17. So he's got to beat a 17 with a strength save. And I have luck points too, so we'll. So I don't think that works on him. No, I think it yeah. only works on you. What did he get? <laughs> he critically <laughs> failed. Right. <laughs> so so it will it will work like petrification. So now now he can't move. Um. But uh, petrification, yeah. Auto fail strength, auto fail dex, yeah. Yeah, yeah, no, no, no. He's not petrified yet. So okay. what happens with like Medusa, for example, is yeah, you, you, he has to fail two rolls in a row to be petrified. So he now can't move as the wax is hardening around him. When it's his yeah. at the end of his next turn, he's going to do another roll. If he succeeds that, he breaks through. If he fails, he will just be completely cemented, and then okay. you could just fuck him up. I'm just gonna like slot jam or whatever. Yeah, call yeah, it. yeah, yeah. Know, slot like jam. It's... Yeah. All right. Well, William. I mean, Ragnar, you're up. Unless you want to do anything with the bonus action, William. Uh, I'm I'm pretty good. Actually, I'm just gonna move back to where Jimmy is. I'm gonna yeah, you're just gonna to like Jimmy. retreat Jimmy, back to it's... Jimmy. It's okay. Sorry, Jimmy. You got this. Hey. Right. I mean, I've shed blood before. I was in prison. Did you got this, man? Why? I got this. It doesn't hurt as much as I. As it normally does, actually. Yeah, that's because of that inspiring table flip we all did together. Hey! <laughs> when William rolled his devil fruit, I also turned into a big yeah, bear. Yeah, yeah. I, I, I mean, we would do that before yeah, yeah, we yeah. arrived. Yeah. yeah. Um, and then I look over at the slots guy and I say, "This is for Jimmy." <laughs> and I three times. I mean, you hit him three times. <laughs> oh damn! Damn. Oh, you're fucking up slots. You are fucking petrified. slots oh. so hard. Oh my god. I like to gamble. Oh my god. With your life. Whoa! Oh. <laughs> like, I mean, <laughs> as you cut into him, like, coins are coming out of him, things are flying out of slots. And he's like, oh, oh, no! Um, it's now slots' turn. He can still do his thing, he just can't move. Uh, so he's gonna, as the wax is crawling around him, he's gonna grab the handle on his slots. And he's gonna push it down. And he's gonna roll them slots, baby. Let's go. It's slots time. Roll them odds. This is not damage, by the way. 94. I was gonna say, holy don't, shit. Don't worry. It's, it is not Damn. damage. 94 damage to Ragnar. It, it is not damage. <laughs> <laughs> it, is, it is a roll. He rolls 1 to 100. And depending on what he rolls, something happens. Uh, oh, boy, I like this. I like this idea. Uh, I gotta find my fucking chart. I kind of feel bad that I petrified him now. It's okay. You haven't yet. It's all right. If he fails yeah, the yeah. roll, then yes. If he doesn't, then no. Uh, all right. All right. What is what is it? 94? 94. 94. Um, a giant egg appears in front of both Ragnar and Slots. Oh. That's this dude just, sucks eggs. That, <laughs> ah, that's good. Verona, you're really with the comedy this time. Um, okay. And then he's going to do another strength save, which he fails, and he turns into a uh, wax statue. Oh. My, my final words. My final <laughs> thing. Take this egg. 
Like when when he pulls the lever down, you see like he does egg, 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 three across <laughs> the road, and now there's just an egg there as he turns into a so wax is statue. Is he like is he like a human? Does he need to breathe, or was he a robot? I don't. I guess we'll find out. Guess you'll find out. But he's <laughs> yeah, now we'll petrified. Um, and yeah, there he is. Um, cool. Well, <laughs> well, that kind of sucks, huh? So there's now this egg there, though. So it's now Jimmy's turn. Jimmy whips uh, out his gun. Hey, what do I do? I shoot the dice guy. Shoot the egg. Shoot the cement for- man. Uh, I'm not sure about the egg yet. Hit hit the dice guy square in his dice eyes. <laughs> Ooh, I've never shot a gun before in my life. <laughs> you were in prison. Yeah, but I know how to use a knife. Oh, all right. Well, I'm not giving you my sword, so you're just going to have to work with it. Uh, he, he hit him. He hit him. <laughs> okay, yeah. Oh, really, that's a really good shot as well. It's like the max damage he could do. Bing, I'm telling yeah. you what, this guy, man, he's going to be the next pirate. He's gonna. He's working out. I can see him. He you know? spins the pistol in his hand. <laughs> I'll do it the way Jimmy does it. Bada bing. Bada boom. Uh, now it's Pip the Dice Boy. Uh-oh. And he goes... Well, I didn't even take his health off from fucking... Oh, no, I did. I did. I did. He just has not That's taken it. that much health. Okay, Pip the Dice Boy looks over at Jimmy and he, he goes, How dare you do that to me? I'm Pip the Dice Boy! And he puts out his hand, and a bunch of D6 dice fly at Jimmy's face. Why is he trying to hurt Jimmy? <laughs> well, Jimmy, no! <laughs> Jimmy, no! Uh, please, please, crit fail. He's so funny if it did. Zawolfo! Uh, yes! You're right in front of him! <laughs> yes, I am right next right. to him. Does this even hit, though? Does a thir- 13 would hit Jimmy? Uh, let me. That, roll a 1D4. Yeah, wait, 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 yeah, just roll that 1d4, because that would be the disadvantage. So roll a 1d4. Okay. Please be 4. Yes! Let's go! Oh my god! <laughs> so, um, as the dice fly out of uh, Pit Boy's hands, um, you, I mean, fucking Zawolfo just comes out and just, he's going crazy today. He just grabs all the dice, <laughs> he like, he gets out a little dice bag and just puts it in the dice bag and ties it up and just puts it on the table. And then like, <laughs> fucking rubs his hands. Wait, Good job, Zawolfo. <laughs> Give him a high five. Yeah. <laughs> and Jimmy goes. I know there's tables. Man, that, that <laughs> you try to fight me? I'm invincible. I'm Jimmy. He's uh, Jimmy. <laughs> okay. Just like, just He's Jimmy. Go well, out. Pip the dice boy, obviously frustrated, is now just going to attack Verona instead. Oh. Uh, it's all right. Verona can take it. Can he? Yes, Probably. He can. Well, five. Is that it? Doesn't that, that. it? Just doesn't hit. <laughs> he just, just fires the <laughs> dice, and they just like scatter on the ground. Uh, so yeah, you're, you're Nate guys. I guess. <laughs> <laughs> I guess he didn't have the odds. <laughs> the odds oh. were not in his favor. Oh, oh. such yeah. a shame. Okay, well that's it. That's 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 dice boy. Duros, okay. you're up. How dare you hurt my Jimmy? Or try to, I should say. <laughs> and I leap <laughs> off uh, the roulette table and I go towards the, uh, Pip the Dice Boy with one mighty swing, trying to knock him on his butt once again. If I can, just like knock him over with a kick. Um, or just the back end of my blunt sort of trip attack if I can. Go ahead. I mean, you hit him. Oh, fantastic. And then he has to make a strength save. He sure uh, does, Dice Boy. So eight, so eight plus my five. Plus four. Is he, he's got to beat that. Eight, five, four. <laughs> you don't need. To, I think it's already on. If you go 17. to your spells, I think it's already there. But all right. Okay. Uh, in terms of the, the strength saving throw, seventeen. He fails. Nine. He falls over. Baff. Let's go. A bunch of baby. His dice body bits scatter across the ground. Aya. Uh, right. ha, ha. Then, then a, I guess a D10, D10 as well. Yeah. And now you have advantage on the attacks against him. As he took 13 I damage. Do. So now to slice off those eyes and make it snakes, I guess. That's, that was yeah, you hit him. Yeah, you I, hit him I twice. <laughs> Going for those snake eyes. And, well, that's not too bad. 17. <laughs> that's not oh, too bad. the humanity. Oh, <laughs> fuck, you know. Oh, I'm dice boy and I'm in pain. Yeah. All right, Verona. 
you're about to be in a crap load of pain. <laughs> Man, this is great. We should do comedy here sometime after this is all over with. Yeah. yeah this is the strongest <laughs> crew in the world. Bada bing, bada boom. Well, bang, bang. I bang. mean, you hit him bang. three times. Dice boy. There we go. Uh, yeah, that is uh, 23 plus 7. 30! Whoa! That was easy maths! I just did that Her in my oh head! Oh my god! Easy. Yeah. I didn't have to Even type I anything in. I just I did it in my brain! Oh my god, you did 30 damage you fire three shots pumping out. Like, every time you, you shoot a bullet at him, like, imagine, like, his body is one big dice, but when you hit it, it, it like, creates a ripple of lots of tiny dice as they sp splinter out. <laughs> um... And his, and his blood is almost just lots and lots of, like, D4s and D6s. <laughs> uh, oh, no! He screams <laughs> out. Um, what else are you going to do, Verona? That uh, that's it. That's it. William, you're up. Yeah, just three attacks. Would I be able to make a wax shield for Jimmy and also attack, or I only have to do one of those things? Uh, it's your action to do your wax stuff, so. Right, right, right. And um, I think you have a limited, like... Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm gonna make yeah. a wax shield for Jimmy. Cool. It make a, yeah. it, it's just gonna function like the shield spell. But yeah, like, like permanently. Plus, like, oh, yeah, like that's fine. So yeah, so he's got I like a. I think he just gets a plus five AC. Oh no, a plus two yeah. AC. I was gonna say, oh no, plus five. Plus no, no, five no. is fine. Plus two. I, it's not gonna function like the shield spell. It'll just function like you give it him the has, shield has, bonus. I'm giving him a shield. It's yeah. a cool shield. It has like the devil's luck sigil on it. So he gets like, that plus two. Blah, 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 blah. Here you go, Jimmy. Hey! Wield it with pride. I've got a gun. I got a shield. I'm pimping out over here. Oh yeah. Can I make? Can I make him a shield and a and a knife, or can it just be one of the two? Uh, just a knife and shield set. Sure. It's a knife. Okay. Just a here, knife. There you go. He Whoa! Has a, a knife. <laughs> wax knife. Wax hey! shield. Good to go. Ooh, All yeah. right. All right. Amazing. There he is. Standard equipment. Let's go. <laughs> Starting equipment. Strapped. All right, Ragnar. <laughs> go ahead. Uh, <clears throat> Duros, jump on! I walk over to Duros. Okay. Ooh, I jump up in the egg. <laughs> <It's> all right. <laughs> yeah. Sweet. Let's make these guys regret the day that they faced off against the Devil Luck Pirates. And a nice swing three times. Um, the second one misses, but the first two hit. Well, you have advantage because Pip the Dice Boy is on the floor. Oh, yeah, it's advantage. Oh, is it? So it's just reroll the, the second one. Okay. Yeah. Well, you could get crits on the You others. could, but... Ah, it's fine. You guys it's are fucking. Oh. I mean, you're gonna crit on that one. <laughs> yeah. yeah, do the damage, yeah, buddy. Yeah. Oh my god. I'm gonna. Oh. I, I mean, I'm gonna. <laughs> I'm gonna. I'm gonna do a calculator for this one. Everyone blows. Up. Are you big bear? I am big yeah. bear. He oh my god, bear. he's huge bear. That's why he's doing so much fucking damage. Giant bear. You can only use this once a day. Forty-seven. Oh. I mean, you cut him down, just so dramatically. He is. His dice is spilling everywhere. Oh no! I didn't think fighting would be like this. Big Tom said it would be okay. He said he would protect me. Big Tom, help me! I think you were like a father to me. Now, now I kind of feel bad. Maybe we don't kill this guy. Maybe we don't kill this guy. I mean, <laughs> when you make it, yeah. If you, if you want to give up, that's fine. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, we kind of came in here as, like, a big raid and, like, <laughs> cutting everybody down. But, I dude, I mean... That. I don't want to die. I just want to be Dice Boy. <laughs> all, all, all right. If you promise to give up, then. I thought we'll... I was really strong. <laughs> I thought I... He was... well, you were really wrong. Well, yeah. <laughs> big big Top always said I was his strongest little dice boy. Oh. It always made me so oh, happy. This... I thought I could I handle myself in a real fight. <laughs> I... This is, um, hmm. This is really awkward now. Isn't this it? is getting very awkward, yeah. But a lot yeah. of times when we let people live that are awkward, they usually come back to fight us later. <laughs> we no, can I, I, out. no, I don't think so. I think Helios was fine. Oh, yeah, sure. Yeah. Well, oh, he's not fighting any. Why don't you make me remember Helios? <laughs> yes. was, we were doing the whole like we were in like the adrenaline with the attack, and now it's like ah oh, Helios. Now, man. now I'm depressed. Yeah. Uh, uh, no. uh, <laughs> tell you what, take your friend's egg and maybe your friend who's petrified maybe for life, um, and just uh, get out of here and maybe have a new life somewhere. <laughs> <laughs> really? 
Also, does your friend the slot machine need to breathe? Because yeah. that's going to be a serious problem. Oh, well, how long do humans live without oxygen? Uh, <laughs> that's a good question. <laughs> yeah, it sure Can is. Can control that wax? Oh, I, I guess I... No, when I said it, when I said it, it's set. Yeah, I mean, I mean I he like... could. It's like a few minutes. It's technically only been six seconds, so. Yeah. <laughs> well, uh, you could like probably melt off his head or like give him a little. Yeah, I mean, it's actual. Just give him some air. Just give it him has air. it has the properties of wax. You could just melt it with a flame. Yeah. If only right, Pearl we'll were just... here. Yeah, well. <laughs> just get a lighter and help your friend out for maybe a few hours. <laughs> we will be fine. Just get out of our sight. We have business with the boss. Yes. Ragnar, flip a table for dramatic effect. Yeah. <laughs> Two tables at once. Uh, Pip Boy starts to run away. As Pip Boy starts to run away, he grabs his friend's slots and he starts like, he gets, he's like hammering away, trying to crack the um the wax. He makes the little breathing hole for him so he doesn't die. Uh. And he's like running away. <laughs> um, but as he's running away, the egg starts to hatch. Okay. <sighs> Shit. And um, what, what does the egg do, by the way? <laughs> yeah. I don't know. He was, he <laughs> and he, he's running away. And inside, <laughs> well, no, he wouldn't know because Slots is the one that did it. So he inside the like egg it. is a tiny little man. Oh. Like a okay. like he looks like a regular man, but scaled all the way down, like this big. And he looks up, Hello, and he man. has his hands on his hips, and he goes, "Well, well, 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 what's all this then, huh? All right? <laughs> what's wait, going wait, on? Was there a, was it a regular sized <laughs> egg? Uh, I'd say it's probably a bit bigger than regular sized. It's like head sized egg. Like an Aren't ostrich mammal, egg. Sir? Okay. How are you inside right. of an egg? Ah, uh, well, I'm just as <laughs> I, honestly, I'm just as confused as you are. I mean, um, is he naked? Uh, no, he's fully dressed. <laughs> like, okay. oh, wow. I mean, fully dressed. he's just a fully dressed guy. He looks like he's maybe in his mid thirties. Well, well, I guess I'm a. How, well, how are you doing? And he walks out, and he and he he pulls out a small little pair of glasses and puts them on. He goes, "Yeah, well, guess I'm alive now, huh? Yeah, well, uh, it would it in, would seem so. Um, in, enjoy your well, life. Good good luck. Good luck to you. Hey, um, <laughs> thanks, fun. guys. Uh, in this rat race, we call a life. Uh, go out, get a job, get married, have some kids, yeah. die. You know, that's just how it goes. Think I might repeat, right? Yes. Uh, I got a, <laughs> I got a life ahead of me. I think. I got, right. I got dreams. I got dreams. I think. I'm happy for you. Uh, good luck with every whatever you guys are doing. Yeah, we're gonna go kill the boss of this place, but we we got no well, issues with you. You're just a guy living his life. I'm just okay. living my yeah. life. I'm just a guy, just a friendly little dude. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah. Well, all right, it's everybody. So Nothing right, but guy. carnage happening behind this. <laughs> yeah, there's so much to just like, like, like right, I mean, right as he <laughs> says that, right as right as he's like talking to you guys, like the elephant like throws a guy into a table next to you, <laughs> <laughs> and he's like, "Well, it seems a little bit dangerous here." Um, I it might, would seem so. I've always wanted to be um, an accountant. I think. Well, I mean, this well, might not be the best place for it, but if you can get out of here in one piece, maybe you could... Uh, oh, one piece! Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> and he just walks off into the sunset. <laughs> you know, if I had a penny for every time someone wanted to become an accountant, I'd have two pennies. Which isn't a lot of money, but it's still strange that there's two of them. The, the accountant so business is... Like, yes. <laughs> I, I, know, I know I was literally born a few minutes ago, but the accountant business is seemingly booming. Uh, well, I see. I see. Uh, I'll be off then. People have numbers. They need to keep track of said numbers. I'm not one for math, so if you're good at math, that seems like a good profession for you. Oh, wait. Before I go, actually. Um, yes. I realize that you lot uh, have just uh, I brought me into this world. Um, mm. I... I, I, I Guess it's up to you guys to name me. Feel weird if I name myself. I mean, I I I don't care. Um, what what do Jimmy, you guys think? What do you think, Jimmy? Hey, name. There's a small man over here. Uh, <laughs> he there he at that he is Jimmy. Why don't we call him Vinny in honor Ver of Jimmy? Verona, do you have an idea? Just thinking about Rick. Ah, <gasps> uh, I remember Rick. Rick was a Rick. nice guy. You are. You can be the next Rick. Hey. One of the greatest men I ever knew. I reach out my finger just to like shake his hand. Hey, nice, nice to hey, meet uh, you, Rick. Very right, swell, hey, guys. Ca Captain, I have an idea. Yeah, L little Ricky. Uh, 
We're Ricky. really bad at keeping track of our finances. Would you like to join our crew and become an accountant <laughs> for us? <laughs> well, well, well. I like, I like your, your thinking, Ragnar. <laughs> I could be little Ricky the accountant for you lot. Do you got a pirate ship? We, we do. We do got a pirate ship. We do, yes. Well, <laughs> off I go. <laughs> what is it? What does it look like? It's uh, It's got a bear on it. It's got a bear on it's it. You can't miss it. Yeah, yeah. All right, can't, can't miss it. Can't miss tell, it. Gra- tell Gravy Ragnar sent you to keep track of our money. I I don't know if this will help much, but I make him a little tiny wax sword to protect himself. Oh, here you go. Sir. It's like the size of a letter opener. Like, here you go. Thank you, <laughs> guys. I, I just imagine like every time we're like, how much money do we have? Like, little <laughs> Rick <laughs> comes out of the door like, you have exactly this much money. <laughs> uh, little Rick, little Ricky, you're going to be our new accountant. OK, we're, we're getting we're expanding the crew today, guys. We got a cabin boy. We got a we, we got um, an, an accountant. accountant. Yeah, we're great. Oh, yep. and by the way, I just remembered that I have the knives I actually took off of Motz's body. So I'm just going to no, give those. Them, didn't we? No, I took them. I made a point yeah. to mention I picked those things up because I'm like, those are really cool knives. I'm going to keep them. Ross, just said that they're just normal knives. They're normal <laughs> knives, but I'm just going to give holes them to in Jimmy. Them. They look cool. I'm just, I'm just going to give them to Jimmy because he's the hey! knife expert. Yeah, so there you go. They got, I got knives over here. And All right, they have holes in them. You got a wax sword, a wax shield, a gun, grenades, and real knives that were wielded by a mouse. You are ready to go, Jimmy. I'm strapped up. Okay, we're good. How big is he? How Uh, big is the little tiny Rick? Or little Ricky? Yeah, how big is he? Is he like a foot tall? Let's settle that right now. the size of someone's head, right? Something like that. Hold on. Uh, No, he's smaller than that. Okay. Uh, so like half a foot? He's like what six are we wor- inches. What are we working with here? What are we working <laughs> he's, with? He's, oh. he's the size of this cap- cappuccino cup. When All I right, well, him, which I don't is know. Nine inches. Well, I, I only got American sizes. I don't know what. The- I got six inches. How about that? He's I'd six say he's about tall. six inches, yeah. He's about six this inches, height nine. right here. Okay, there the we go. Average penile length. Got it. All right. Yeah. Right. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> maybe a little bit smaller, like maybe five inches. <laughs> Okay, he's five inches. All right, five yeah. inches canonically, right there. There's, there's, yeah. there's a uh, little Ricky. Okay, yeah, okay, Briggs, what's going on? <laughs> <laughs> That's good because I can see him sitting on, like, standing on somebody's shoulder with this height. So this is uh, good. Yeah, yeah this yeah. is good. Yeah, okay. Wow, well, right. he's. I mean, he's almost as short as you, taking. Yeah, almost. 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 <laughs> I'm. I'm at least ten inches tall. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Right, I'm glad. I'm glad we established that. Glad we established yes, that. Okay. yeah. For the for the sake of the wiki, we need to establish that. Yeah, now. we need to know. Yeah, I never thought I'd see William holding holding a fucking measuring tape, being like, "I got six inches." <laughs> <laughs> That's um, impressive, yep. Captain. Six whole inches. Six whole inches. Wow, that should be added to the SBS. Uh-huh. <laughs> Wait, what? Are we talking about the dick sizes of the Devil's Luck crew pirates? Yes, we are. Thank you for. Wait, really? Are we? <laughs> are we? Should we roll for it? Roll for dick size. <laughs> roll for it. All right. But no, we're not we rolling for that. Uh, Is it just a d twenty? We... No, it would. Well, Why would it just d- be a d twenty? <laughs> roll it. Do we add our modifiers, proficiency bonus. No. <laughs> I, I would. <laughs> <laughs> I would say a D12. No, it wouldn't. No, 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 I feel like it would be 2d4 plus your constitution modifier, maybe. That's, oh. that sounds or, fair. Or maybe half your constitution modifier, round it down. That's r- round because it down, the, right. the average Zero. Because the okay. average of 2d4 <laughs> is 5, which is the average penis size in All the right, world. Let's, okay, you know this off the top of your head, okay. Um, and then you you add your constitution, so you'd be slightly more than that. All right, let's 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 We're not, do that. Are we Why doing not? this? Are we yeah, doing this it? has to be. We, we got to do has it. to be resolved before we continue. I, th- I think yeah. I hate. I hate. I hate this. <laughs> All right. I just. So are we what, really doing this? So what are we doing? Two D four plus the con modifier. I'd say half. yeah, half your con run rounded rounded down. Because obviously okay. you wouldn't want to like add four constitutions. So it'd be if you have four, it goes to two. If you have three, it goes to one. Two. It goes All right. Two D four for me. Okay, got it. So just two D four for Duros. Little Dick Duros is what they call him. Six. You got a six? Solid. Oh, I still don't know Solid. how to roll. <laughs> I'm average. 
<laughs> oh, the backslash I'm, I'm, before the R. I know, I know. Corona's nice. No, right, 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 no, you. No! <laughs> hold up! All right, hold up! Hold up! Ragnar, Ragnar, you haven't added your constitution. Uh, so, so it would be plus one for Ragnar. Holy shit! All right. All right. So Ragnar, Rag, <laughs> Duris and Ragnar, Ragnar are six, six inches. Verona's four. And wait, William, have you added your constitution? All right. So that would be my con is uh, the con mod is three. So it'd be one. Oh. So yours is one. three. Three you know, inches thick. Those all yeah. make sense, right? Those all yep. make sense. Yep. Two, six I inches. Would have it, five... I would have it no other way for William. Can William use a luck point? <laughs> nah. Oh nah, that's not how it works. Luck point. I am so it's sorry for everyone who's... Li I'm so sorry. I know there are people listening who are going to listen yeah. to this little portion and be like, I hate this. This is the worst. Why are they doing this? I feel very uncomfortable. I, I, am, I apologize for that and, and you got to realize that I'm I actually am very sorry about that um, but now at least this is on William the wiki. feels how do you think William feels about this <laughs> all right this is anyway amazing. it had well, to be done Louis Lecoq is a seven inch penis by the way <laughs> yeah, Louis Louis Lecoq <laughs> Louis Lecoq <laughs> Oh god, damn it. Oh god. Oh my god. Oh man, it's like a freaking oh. python down there. Oh man. <laughs> Holy shit. I can't. All That's right. Great. You gotta do That's... Cyril. Cyril. No, 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 no. All right, no, let's, no, no, how about we get back we're to the good. fight let's for right now? Yeah, let's get okay. back. We <sighs> can save these hypothetical dick sizes for later. Oh. Um yes. All right, so... Okay, so, yeah, the fighting and commotion is continuing to go down. Uh, roulette stress pieces that uh, continue to fuck people up. There there are other, like, interesting-looking um, big-top mafia don... Ma no, mafia goons that are, are being destroyed. Like, the elephant has, like, got someone on one of his tusks and, like, throwing them around. Um, I mean, it it very much looks like your side is winning here. Uh, mm -hmm. um, are you just going to beeline for the main building, the big-top... The big-top... So oh, is yes. it is it just like a um, like a staircase, a door? Like what is it? I mean, it it it, it in itself is another smaller castle inside the bigger sort of castle walls. Oh, okay. Uh, it's got stairways leading up to it. They're gilded. Um, fancy, fancy. Okay. Yeah. Uh, and All right. by the way, before I run out of this wax fruit, um, does anybody want like a wax weapon? Anybody want anything cool? You good? All right. I'm okay uh, with. What I'm I good. Have. I mean, yeah. yeah. All right. I don't. I don't wear armor. Yeah, that's or a good point. Your yeah, your yeah. devil fruits abilities only will last for like ten minutes, don't they? Yeah. So I'm probably gonna have to roll it again. Yeah, yeah. So that battle, they are yeah. probably gonna run out by the time you actually get. Hey, to uh, hey, hey, guys. I'm gonna I'm gonna go drain my snake on on the way to this gas. I'll be right back. All right. Cool. Just go off to the bathroom, Ragnar. All right. He I, just pisses uh, on the gilded pillar, like on there. I, I'm having a terrible time. <laughs> I'm right. sorry. No, no, it's all good. It's all good. I'm not. I'm not. I'm, like, I'm not. I mean, um, the dick that was size both question. Uncomfortable and hilarious. Okay. Actually. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, you got to do what you got to do. The question was posed. I mean, like... you guys charge up the stairs. Ragnar pissing. Uh, I'm not rolling for Jimmy. The chat is begging me to roll for Jimmy. I'm not. You you charge up the stairs. Um, and I mean, the doors have already been busted because like goons have been yeah. thrown against it. The 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 busted in, so you enter into into the palace, and you're running down the corridor as your as your crew. And you you get uh, you run up more stairs. You know you you ignore all the offshoot rooms until you get to the front door of the main like room. At Duras, you already recognize the route. From yes, being here I've before. been in here before. But in front of the door uh, stands a man who is just one giant playing card. And um, what's up, Verona? All right. What card is it? Uh, oh, <laughs> this is important. Uh, well, <laughs> yeah, I, I would have to ask that too. Yeah, uh, currently, really it's the it, it's the Ace of Hearts. But as he looks mm. down at you, the 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 uh, the symbol on the card turns into like a big shield. Oh, uh, it turns into a big shield, and then it turns into an angry face. Then it turns into a finger that like wags back and forth. Um, and right. he's not talking I'm... to you. He's just making these like symbols. 
on the card. All right, uh, cards are my thing. So I, I'm like, I'm offended by this thing's existence. Like, <laughs> just like, what? No, 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 no. This is, I do card tricks. You, I uh, know. Okay. So I'm going to roll, I'm going to roll my devil fruit again. Before go we ahead. Go this. this time I won't. Right. 378. Okay. 378. What could that possibly be? Is that something? And for those of you wondering at home, that was my. Third. I have two more of these after this. Three hundred and seventy-eight. So that sounds like Logia range. You can. I hope it is. It is. Uh, Moku me. You can manipulate and turn into wood. So you got wood Logia. <laughs> oh wood no, Ragnar. Um, <laughs> all right. Hold up, though. The Oasis it does, guys. It, <laughs> it does have this caveat: the wood that you create is dead wood. You can only manipulate wood that is dead. Oh, which is yeah, that's the important caveat well, there. But I'm still a this building's Logia. made that's of wood, probably. I uh, it's made of stone, but I'm, I'm uh, still, gold. I'm it's still actually a made of gold. Yeah, but <laughs> that's, that's fine. But yeah, you can manipulate wood, and you are wood. All right, uh, I think cool. yeah, that's pretty I much like that. That that is like Timberlord's ability. I, I, I'm almost. actually going to roll with that one just because it's still a Logia. So yeah, let's. let's actually, okay. no, his, his wasn't a Logia. He just had Paramis Paramis who control right. wood. But I have a Logia. Yeah, so. yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay, attacks can pass. All right, cool. So are we doing initiative again or? Oh, I guess no. Just it's, the um the card points at William, and then okay. and then the symbol on the card is like a hand, and then it goes like a, like a almost like a two frame animation <laughs> of a hand beckoning you forwards. And then he, then it's like a fist. I'm just gonna, I'm charging and slicing this thing. Yeah, roll to hit him. Okay, oh. here we go. Ooh, hey. He's, a, he's a giant sentient card. This is what I was born to do. All right, I fair, I guess. Seventeen. You, yeah, you hit him. Okay. Um, ah! And you just cut the card in half, and the card turns into like a, a shocked face, and then like an exclamation mark that's like flashing in Ooh. and out, and then. <laughs> <laughs> and then like 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 almost two hands almost like trying to put himself back together and then it's like a sad face uh and an exclamation One mark flashing and then it's like a his eyes that are like an x and a sad face and then the card just flutters down and is yeah. just there in two pieces on the One ground. One hit kill everybody. Um that was easy. I, I, I... I think we could have just moved it aside, but all right, Captain, let's go. <laughs> let's. Go. I'll take that as a one-hit kill. Um, you're not taking that away from me. I'll, I'll do that. Okay. All right. All right. right. First open. I the guess door, you I could guess. say he cut the deck. Cut the deck. Cut all right. the deck. Uh, all right. Huh. I've I, I've named so many techniques like hard cut today. at this point, so I'm like, I'll just yeah, whatever. Okay. Uh, I right. guess I'm at the door, so I guess I'll. Is it locked? No. Nope. I open the door. You open the door and the doors open up. And you see this bespeckled golden room with a golden desk. Uh, you see the TV screens that are on the walls that um, Duras remembers. You remember the layout of the room, Duras. Uh, mm -hmm. You see like all of the uh, the general gambling uh, and golden trophies. And and the out the back, there is that big window that shows the, uh, the ocean. Um, and Big Top is on the... Sitting in his chair, um, and you you look him over. You look at his dead, lifeless eyes, and his bloodied chest, and blood pouring his down his mouth. As as you realize, is instead the dead body of Big Top, and uh, standing in front of uh, Big Top is this like wooden mannequin that turns round. Um, oh shit! And then. All of the TV screens turn on. And on the TV screen, you see this, uh, almost like this boy with this like white hair, slightly bluish headband. He's got a blue, a cyan blue and an orange eye. He's got like a single earring and one thing. Uh, he's got kind of almost like a fancy jester outfit in a way. And he stares down and he goes, hello. Hello, is that the Devil Lux Pirates? <laughs> hello? Hi. Uh, hello, there. <laughs> Hi, my name's Ragnar, I'm a bear. I know who you lot are. <sighs> and he, he sighs deeply. And he... Did you kill that guy? Because if so, thank you. Oh, of course I did. You lot are getting in my way. 
I'm here to take over the Oasis for my boss. Oh, uh, here we oh, go. Another coup. Oh, uh, a coup on top of a coup. <laughs> a coup de coup. A coup de coup. <laughs> <laughs> well, I tried to get you to leave the island so you wouldn't get in my way. Oh, are you the creepy puppet guy? <laughs> you remember me. Yes. I tried to take over the eons as well for my boss, but you killed everyone there, so there was no one to take over. The and I, I didn't like that. No, I didn't. I didn't like that at all. And neither did my boss. So I'm here, trying to take over the Oasis. I gave you the option to leave. I guess you lot are not as stupid as I thought you were. <laughs> uh, no, of course not. We are the apex of logic. Ah, yes. The pinnacle <laughs> of intelligence. Duros, am I using the word apex correctly? It's, it's like means top. It's, it's good enough. Yeah, it's good enough. Okay, good enough. Yeah, all right, cool. <laughs> that sounds like a good game. <laughs> 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 I would buy that for a dollar, Ragnar. It seems like Ragnar would be a legend at that game. <laughs> <laughs> they used to call me Blue Thunder in another life. <laughs> so, to... <laughs> you lot are very funny. I like that. It's the same... We feel humor helps be a good pirate crew. Yeah, yeah, I agree. I respect you, you know that. I didn't want mm. you to die. I was happy you lot were still alive. But, you know, we have to do what we have to do. I suppose. And, uh... Oh. Since you're gonna die anyway... Um... I, th I guess you're wondering about all the puppets. How many puppets are in this room? Um, I mean, as he, as he says that, like... <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. As he says that, like, kind of crawling out from behind of, like, all of the oh, different objects no. and stuff and the wardrobes and things, a bunch of mannequins come out. And at the moment, they're just faceless mannequins. And then he says, um, So, I have the ability to, to create these puppets, and they are... Uh, they, they are replicas of real people. I mean... Oh. Unfortunately, they are replicas of alive people, because if uh, somebody dies, then my Devil Fruit ability doesn't work. Um, I also can use my Devil Fruit ability through my puppets, which is why I'm able to do this, and I'm at no risk of myself. All I need is some sort of DNA, and I'm able to do it. And lucky for me, you lot left a lot of DNA in the Eon's little, little cathedral. And then you see the puppets' faces slowly shift, and one of them starts to look like Verona, and one ah! of them starts to look like Duros, one of them starts to look oh. like Ragnar, oh, one of them shit. starts to look like William. Um, oh my God, he's uh, as handsome as a. What about <laughs> over there? And one of them starts oh, to look like Louis Lefort. Oh no! <sighs> I always knew this was how William was gonna die. Can I wave at mine? Does he wave at mine? <laughs> no, they all look like dead and lifeless in their eyes. Oh. Um, they all are right. not dead wood because they're being brought to life. <laughs> they yeah. are not right. dead wood. Um, uh, so I, I wanted to make that clarification. <laughs> I'll be the luckiest one. <laughs> no, just like they're being given. They are being given. They, there is life pumping through them. That's sort of how the the uh, yeah. the devil fruit functions. Um, I mean, Ragnar's axe is still super effective against them because they're still wood. Uh, they're still they have wood. a little bit of fun. Um, I, uh, you, you've impressed me, the Devil's Luck Pirates, and I think you've uh, managed to kill people I didn't think you were able to kill. Um, but let's see how good um, you are at killing yourselves, as we say. <laughs> I've done it once before. <laughs> yeah, we have we have practice doing that. Yeah. Everybody aim for Duros first. Uh, wait, wait, hold on, Nancy. Wait, wait, guys. Guys, guys. guys. Wait, wait, wait. I'm confused. I'm gonna attack myself because I'm gonna. I'm gonna I guess something. we're fighting each other here. Yeah. Um, right, and I, I, I mean, as the mannequins approach you. You're, you're looking into a reflection of yourselves and the dude's laughter echoes throughout the room and then the TV screens shut off. Um, 
I mean, we're about to get into combat. I think that's as good a point as any to do a to be continued. Yeah, yeah. All right. 